Hello everybody, this is Xlodo, and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Side by Side. Now, there's been a little bit of changes in the format of how I want to do this. I'm basically going to start over at this point. I am not going to be uh, blending videos together as I was, but instead I'm going to do this more like a conventional LP. I'm just going to play the game, I'm going to comment on it, and then I'm going to play the next game and comment on it. And uh, so it's more like how I'm actually doing it. Obviously, I'm not actually playing all the versions of the game side by side at the same time. So hopefully this will go a lot smoother for me. I won't have to do any monstrous video editing, and uh, so let's get started. Uh, first of all, uh, you may know that I had moved my um, uh, home base, so to speak, from um, from here at YouTube to uh, Blogspot. I was using uh, blogger.com and, and doing little write-ups about this. And uh, on there I had uh, constructed a poll for uh, what kind of character name I'd use. Well, since I'm starting over again, I'm going to uh, start over with a new name as well. But I'm going to use the same poll results. So I'm going to use a Germanic name. So. Uh, First, let me just come and run in here. Let's erase Matthias. I had recorded this, started to record a second episode of that, so I'm not too far along. But, uh, yeah, we'll take him out. Let's begin a new quest. And uh, in the meantime, I'm going into my iPhone. I am in an app called uh, Names for RPG. I'm going to use a Germanic name for male, get name. Pex Farber. I really don't know what to make of that. Uh, uh, Farber sounds alright, but Pex is easier to spell in Japanese. Let's go with Pex. That's an uh, interesting little... Are we sure that's Germanic? Germanic. Okay. Alright, Pex. Pex it is. And here we go. Descendant of Erdrek, listen now to my words. And blah 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 blah. <laughs> and uh, in case you're interested, I am playing this right now on my HD TV. Yay! Now, Pex, thou must help us recover the ball of light. The Dragon Lord must be defeated by Pex. Look at my manly pecs. Alright. So. Oh, wow. Status. Low strength. Low HP. Not the best little name we came up with. We'll deal. Alright. Let's take the gold. Take the torch. We'll take the magic key. And obviously we're going to have to talk to people here and there. Let's talk to this one. Why no, I don't know about Princess Gwalen. Why don't you tell me it's been a half a year since she was kidnapped and the king didn't ask for help. Moving right along. Whoops. If thou hast collected all the treasure chests, then you will have a way to open this door. If not, out of luck. Yes, sleep heals everything. Remember this door. And stairs. Do I want to door the stairs? No, I want to stairs the stairs. Alright. Imperial scroll. K 
King Lorik. Uh, it's, it's interesting. You know, we'll see as we look at the other ones, the other versions in the intro here. None of them name the king at the beginning of the game. You have to rescue the princess before you find the name of the king in the Japanese. I don't know why. Breconary used to be a paradise. It's still not so bad. All they have is cute little slimes running around outside. First battle, many foes. Oh man, we used the only key we had. No keys. Torches are not keys. They don't even look like keys. Ah, I hate when that happens. We are merchants who have traveled much in this land. Ow! Twice in a row! Oh, good golly. Rumor has it that entire towns have been destroyed by the Dragon Lord servants. Speaking of servants of the Dragon Lord, uh, you may hear a baby cry in the background. That would be my monitor. And if that happens, I'll be taking a break during recording. Just to let you know. Yeah, he's, uh, he's just past two weeks old. Sixteen days. Awesome. Entering the cave, take with thee a torch. Where can I find Princess Gwilyn? That's what she said! And, of course, Pex's coming was foretold by legend. The legend of Pex. That's what we call it. Oops. Welcome to Tantagil Castle. Tantagel. How do you say that? Tantagel or Tantagel? How would you? I got a deja vu moment. Did I ask that in the other version? The other... video? <sighs> I don't know. Well, here we are on the outside. I... Yeah, let's go on. I was debating whether I should go ahead and talk to the people in town here, but yes, let's do it. Thou art most welcome in Breconary. And as are you. Well, I'll enter the shop and speak to its keeper across the desk. Let's go ahead and talk to the shopkeeper as we go. Now, especially considering our low vitality, I definitely want to boost our attack power first, since all, this is, all that lives nearby is slimes. If we can kill them faster, we'll live longer. So, club it is. Yes, it is okay, period, question mark. Nothing more. Thank you. Alright, old dude. Ah! Old dude. Watch thy hit points when in the poisonous marsh. And you? A too, Brute? Please save us from the minions of the Dragon Lord. Please save us from millions of Dragon Lords. And you, hiding up here in the corner. What's up with you? Beware the bridges! Sounds like a good idea. And you? See King Lorik when thy experience levels are raised. Okay. This is a very short message. Some of the later versions see, gives you a whole little speech. There is a town where magic keys can be purchased. Good to know. Go north, then west. Was it, uh... Go northwest, then southeast. Little inside joke for some people out there. Ah, I have no proof. I knew I should have brought that proof with me. Many have perished. 
but for thee I wish success. What does this mean? Does this mean that he wished the others failure? Does this mean that he wanted others to die? I do not understand. No, you're not. And you? Within sight of the castle. Oh, um, I don't know about Charlock. But, uh, as far as Tantagel, I recently found out that there's a part of the Arthurian legend uh, that Arthur was born at a place called Tintagel. And, uh, of course, that place actually exists in Britain still. There's a town or something. So that was an interesting little tidbit that I never knew. It's been, uh, like, what, 22 years playing this game now? And I never knew that. So, um, Dragon Scale. A nice little boost to, uh, defense rating that doesn't have to be upgraded later. It's pretty good bang for your buck. Two defense, 20 gold. Go for it. Of course, I am aware of the bug that I can sell it and keep the defensive boost, but I'm not going to. I like to play it straight. It's just how I roll. I'm not above taking advantage of a bug here and there, especially when it's out of my control. But if it's in my control, I don't need to. Tell King Lorik that his daughter... Ugh. Alright, and everything else is locked up. I'll just go back up here again one more time. Of course, we have 40 gold. And uh, that's enough to buy clothes right now. But why buy clothes if I can just save up 30 and get the, get the leather armor to start with? Let's do that. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go. Oh, did you notice? Did you see? We're decked out with a sword and our little sprite now. Mm -hmm. We are all that. All that we are. Doo -doo. Oh. And a slime draws near. Yeah, I should, uh... I mentioned that I'm playing this on my HD TV. I did not mention that I'm playing it uh, on a... with the... playing on a... with the... In a, uh, I'm using the um, NTSC filter applied to the emulator output with uh, light scan lines and uh, some color bleed and all sorts of good stuff. Almost looks like the old days. don't know how much of that will show up in the video when I show you, but I can see it. And it's nice and clunky, and I like it. So, I guess I can tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, these uh, little regions near Tantagel and Breconary only have slimes and red slimes in them. Which is good, because anything else will kill us right now. So I'm wandering around here until reaching level 2, which will be at 7 experience points. At which time, I'll see how the Drakis do. If Drakis still pose a sizable threat, then I'll not fight them. And with any luck, I should be able to reach level 3, having only stayed at the inn one time. And that will be about the only time we'll ever have to stay at the inn. Ah, slime attack before Pex was ready. Oh goodness, nice. Two more points, let's do this. Hmm. 
I'm actually surprised to be seeing the number two come up for damage. It just seems like the strength rating turned out so weak. It's almost too much. Oh good, another miss, thank you. Courage and wit, yes. Also, extreme caution, fighting slimes and only slimes. Oh, one? Uh, that's pretty normal for a first level up. Especially on a weak stat. Um, weak stat set. There we go. I'll fight one more slime, and then I'll go into the end. I don't want to push it. Head. I dad. I need to work on talking, don't I? Uh, let me try again. I had considered doing. Oh wow! Doing like some other LPers had done, have done in the past, and uh, and in the present, and. Uh, editing out random battles and things, but I think, for the most part, I'm just going to play through in case anything interesting happens. Because I found out I really hate video editing. It's not a chore that I like. It's, it's actually a chore that I dislike. With a hefty amount of dislikeitude. Alright, so as I said, our goal is to reach 70 gold, and uh, although uh, we won't reach that goal any faster by defeating Drakis, we will get more experience for fighting Drakis. So if we can do it, I'm going to do it. And here they are. Let's see how that goes. Oh. That was nice, but not a good indicator of how easy they are to fight. Still not a good indicator of Drakki battle. There we go. A Drakki draws Nea. Exchanging twos. <laughs> two, two, two. Two, two. Yeah. Hey, two, Brute. Uh, that never gets old. Two. Two. This is amazing. Two. Ow. Oh, three. No, two. <laughs> Uh, I am far too easily amused. Oh. Looks like I'll have to go to the inn one more time. Oh, definitely. That just uses up more gold. Oh, by the way, hi, Sherlock. I always liked the way the whole screen, the whole color palette changes when you get hurt. Uh, it, made, it made me think of like having a, a grievous wound and getting, say, bleeding into your eyes and everything gets coated in a little bit of red. That's what it always made me and my brother think of when we were uh, little playing this. 
because that's the kind of things that little people should be thinking of and, uh, you know, imagining. Mm -hmm. Alright, so what point value comes to level 3? Is it, uh... I think it's 22. Oh, I probably could have stayed out even with 3... No, better not. Better that I went in. Plus, it's 23, it's not 22. There we go, level 3. da 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 been promoted to the next level. There. Only two? Thou hast learned a new spell. Good for us. We can heal us now. Uh, we can heal me. I... I may heal myself. And that will keep us from having to go back to the inn. Ever. Again. Draggy, 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 draggy. Ah, excellent! Six more gold. There we go. Now we got some powers. Now we have some strengths. Now our Kogeki Ryoko is up higher. Yes, I said Kogeki Ryoko. And there we go, 70 gold. Back to town. And there's no reason not to kill another slime. Attack power 10, defense power 5. <coughs> Excuse me. We deal in weapons and armor. Yes, I dost want it. I dost want leather armor. That is okay, period, question mark. Nothing more. And there we go. Defense power 9. Attack power 10. And now, <coughs> for those of you who somehow don't know, I'll show you how you can use this man here as a free in. Talk to him, he restores your magic points. Heal. Talk to him again, he restores your magic points. Heal. Oh. 21? Okay. <laughs> Alright, talk to him. Restore your magic points. And now you're at max. And I suppose I don't have to make you watch me uh, talk to King Lorik. So... I guess now is the time I can start to bid you good night. And at this point, you might as well watch me talk to King Lorik. There it is. Good night. These Imperial Scrolls of Honor. Don't lose them. They're pretty cool. See ya.